Trying to communicate. Where are we going? I want to know where we're sailing to. Hello? Can you hear me? Oh, yeah, 100% it's a tall tale. Yeah, he's doing Shroud Breaker Chapter 3. I just got here, McLee. <laughs> oh, we just hang out until he gets back. That barrel might, or the, the, the barrel, the banana might actually catch on fire before they get back. Oh, he's back. He brought a rowboat. How perfect. I'm just going to leave that there. He'll figure it out. We're going on an adventure! Dude, I could only imagine what Bizarre would do for this. Like, I imagine just the sound of a VCR hitting fast forward. And just <laughs> rolling like crazy. Got a powder keg. What am I hearing? I expected more resistance. Oh my god, all the skellies are firing at the fleet. That's so funny. Grow your boat. Hello. Oh crap, he just sink. <laughs> That's funny. The first thing I do when I start playing this game today is sink a tall tale emissary with a banana and nothing else. With a banana. That's it. A banana. Law abiding liquid. Jesus. <laughs> More Shut up! Hey, we've got a galley. We've got a galley. The fog has made it so I don't really know where that galley is anymore. I don't, I don't really know where that galley is at now, but I know where I can make this a really fun robot adventure. Did someone just engage the big man?
that Taylor is having a bad day. He's just having a really bad day. Let's see. Where is... There it is. It's like, where is the keg I saw when I got here? That poor sloop is just having a bad day, dude. They're just having a bad day. Now, I shall begin stalking the galleon. With my load of powder. Yeah! Ha ha! They're heading due north. Just chasing down a galley that sunk a uh, tall tail sloop. It's only bad because they sunk them twice. I sunk them one time by accident. I put a banana on their stove and left thinking they would hear the banana burning or see the ship on fire and put out the fire. But I saw from a distance that it burned so long it sunk. So. And then I'm rolling around to this fort right here to gather up powder kegs and I see the the, the sloop that's doing the tall tale got back to the island he was at when I sunk him. And this galleon rolls up on him, and I notice that they're together, the two ships, when I see the sloop go down. Dude, they're gonna make this chase take forever. It's been a while since I've chased down a galley this far. Hey! Brigantine crew, don't freak out. I've been chasing that galleon for like 15, 20 minutes. Don't worry about the dude on the rowboat. I'm just chasing down the galley, okay? Don't worry about it. I got your back, merchants. I got your back. Oh no, they're moving again? God damn it. God damn it. <clears throat> oh, here we go. Here we go. I'm on a vengeance mission. I'm avenging a, a tall tail sloop that got bullied by this here galley crew. I watched it happen in real time. Colorized. Job well done. Thank you, Tap. <laughs> you got here just in time, Jefferson. <laughs> and now, the brig. Don't worry, I got him. 
I sunk the galley. I sunk the galley. <laughs> And overboard! <laughs> <laughs> oh, if they get anchored by the galley crew, I'm gonna laugh so hard. F's in the chat for the rowboat. I kind of knew they were gonna blow it. I kind of knew they were gonna blow it. Help! I'm in the water! Drop anchor! Let me up! Let me on your boat! My ship is sunk! Help! You guys are not merchants. <laughs> Watch out for the rock. You're going to crash. I'm going to get eaten by this damn shark. <laughs> That's all right. Quick trip back to a fresh boat. <laughs>